That's anywhere in the world. I don't care where you go, even all over Africa. I mean, it's not going to happen under the system of white supremacy. You have to replace this system with a system of justice because the Chinese uh, are huge in number, and they have always been a threat to the system of white supremacy. But I'm quite sure that the white supremacists, knowing how astute that they are, they are the smartest people on the planet, have proven to be so far, even though they believe in mistreating people, dominating and mistreating people based on color, they are the smartest and most efficient people on the planet because they have had all of the resources and accumulated it over a long period of time to do so. Now, at some point, they're going to have to deal with these people called Chinese because they are the ones who put the Chinese on their feet. They could have crushed them before they even got off the ground. So they are allowing them to do this. So it comes down to why are they allowing them to do this? Do, do they intend to use the Chinese to actually get into a long, drawn-out, hundred-year battle with the people in Africa? Is that the plan of the white supremacists? Because you better believe if they're allowing them to do anything that looks like it's constructive, it has a destructive intent in the long run. That's the way they operate. Mm. They'll start out doing something real nice. Even with the Indians, I mean, they you know they came there saying, "Hey, let's sit down at Thanksgiving. I mean, let's all be nice to each other." 